welcome to Ideas Intelligence, where we bring you the latest buzz from the world of finance and technology. I'm Gloria Methi. And I'm Pooja Sharma. And we are reporters at Ideas Intelligence. Before we dive into the top fintech news of the week, brace yourself for an exciting evening of networking and collaboration as Cedar IBSI Group is organizing Fintech Happy Hour in Bangalore. A one-of-a-kind event where fintechs, VCs, bankers, and like-minded individuals come under the same roof on April 19th. For more details, check the caption below. Starting with the first news of the day, Santander has launched its Open Bank digital offering in the United States and Mexico. The rollout of Open Bank in the US market combines the bank's core proprietary technology to deliver innovative and secure cloud-based banking platform. Up next, Credit Agricole and Worldline have launched CAWL, a new payment services brand aimed at providing tailored services to merchants. This solution will enable merchants to effectively manage their commercial performances and mitigate fraud risks. Moving on, Hokoro, the provider of digital payment term solutions, has announced a 100 million euro debt facility from Viola Credit. With this new financing, Hokoro aims to facilitate 1.5 billion B2B transactions in the next 24 months. Network International and Fintech Suhula are partnering to enable merchants to offer BNPL payment services at its Network Pay Point of Sale Terminal in Egypt. This collaboration aims to enhance access to finance for both banked and unbanked consumers in Egypt. Viola Trade Exchange, an international trade finance service platform, has inked a partnership agreement with Yes Bank. The alliance will offer competitively priced credit solutions for buyers and sellers on the VTX platform. Rounding off with Oman Housing Bank, a provider of housing finance, has selected Temenos to modernize its core banking platform in the cloud. With this collaboration, Oman Housing Bank will be able to develop innovative new products faster on an agile cloud native platform. That's it for this week's top fintech stories. Be sure to check out the links in the description below and follow IBS Intelligence for more such fintech news updates.